In today's video, I want to answer the question, what is a healthy employee turnover rate? The employee turnover rate is one of the most important HR metrics. For instance, a high turnover rate affects profits and company morale. A low turnover rate can signify low career development opportunities. The calculation is pretty straightforward. The first step is to determine the time period. For our example, we will calculate an annual turnover rate for a company of about 100 employees. So you take 12 divided by 100, multiply that by 100, and you get a 12% rate. Once you've done the calculation, it's important to understand who's leaving your company and why. A quick pivot table will filter your data by voluntary versus involuntary, functional versus dysfunctional, department, or manager. Now, just to clarify a couple of terms, functional normally is when you have low performing employees leaving the company. That's a functional termination. Dysfunctional is just the opposite. When you have high performing employees leaving your company, that's dysfunctional. Once you get your rate, you want to understand how you compare to others in your industry. To start that process, you begin by checking the industry standards in the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics. You can find the most recent data at this website. Take a second and jot this down. Once you open the document, go to Table 4, look at Quit Levels. This shows the rates by industry and by, in, and by region. And remember, the rates shown are monthly. Multiply those numbers by 12 to get the annualized rates if you're comparing it to your annualized rate. This number will give you a ballpark estimate of exactly where you stand. Here's the process. Step one, calculate your company's turnover rate. Annualize it. Number two, find your industry on table four. Number three, take the monthly average and multiply it by 12. And number four, compare this number to your organization. Once you calculate and compare your turnover rate, create a breakdown of which employees left your company, voluntary, involuntary, functional, dysfunctional, then you can create an action plan to achieve a healthy turnover rate for your company. Turnover is not bad by nature. It's obviously costly when your most valuable employees leave. When HR professionals pay attention to why employees leave and address those issues, they can retain talent more effectively, thereby stabilizing the turnover rate for their organization. What's next? If you're ready to gain actionable insights from your employee data that's going to be meaningful to upper management, download my free three-step process for tracking KPIs. Go to adams-hr.com KPI and download it immediately. To receive more videos on HR strategies, please like and share this video. Follow me on Instagram at adamshrconsulting.